On the seventh day of Christmas, Ferrante gave to me ultimate fate. Hello, everybody. My name is Mr. C. Ferrante, and today I'll be taking a look at level negative 81, also known as ultimate fate, survival difficulty, class dead zone, environmental hazards, strictly uninhabitable, potential for anomalous entities. Level negative 81 is the 82nd negative level in the back rooms. Level negative 81 is a seemingly quaint British style village. However, it kills any travelers in accidental manners. Description Level negative 81 is a town covered in snow that replenishes daily in the form of a snowstorm. While the houses themselves present an older style of British stone brick architecture, they are all fitted with modern features and appliances. Examples being double glazed windows, central heating, water, and electricity. This level is extremely cold, staying at a constant negative 2 degrees Celsius or 28 degrees Fahrenheit. The floor is slippery and one can easily trip and fall while traversing the level. Each building is entirely furnished, complete with food, water, and even various blunt weapons. The village of level negative 81 expands infinitely. However, there are only a few types of buildings found within this level. Church The churches are relatively uncommon, and they will always contain books, food, and a knife. They also contain headgear to protect from this level's hazards. Detached House Detached houses are one of the most common structures in level negative 81. They will always have Wi-Fi, as well as working lights and gas. However, the gas inside these structures should never be activated. Semi-detached house. Semi-detached houses are another common structure of level negative 81. These will usually lack Wi-Fi, but they do contain almond water, cashew water, and a blunt weapon like a mace or baseball bat. Terraced House Terraced houses are the most common structure in this level. They will contain a diverse amount of supplies and are heavily recommended to reside in. Corner Shops Corner shops will always be found on the ends of terraced houses. They will always store the most amount of food. However, they have no Wi-Fi or weapons. Tea shops. Tea shops are the rarest structure to be found in level negative 81. They have Wi-Fi, heating, gas, electricity, and plentiful amounts of both almond and cashew water. These are heavily recommended to try and survive in due to the natural hazards of level negative 81 happening less inside these structures. Should any damage be done to these buildings or anything be taken from inside them, they will automatically reset within 48 hours. When a building resets, however, what is inside them may differ, making it not a guaranteed method of infinite supplies. While on the surface this level seems perfect for living, Level negative 81 should never be entered. This is due to the fact that anyone who enters is killed by something seemingly accidental. 
Although the patterns of what causes death can be tracked, the likelihood of death grows each day one stays in level negative 81, growing to the point where it becomes impossible to track. Colonies and Outposts There are no known colonies or outposts in this level. Death Correlation through countless sacrifices and research, certain correlations have been found between actions and death. They are as follows. Snowstorms. The daily snowstorms that occur cause a guaranteed death upon entry. It's unknown why, but it is presumed to be the extreme cold, the intensity of the snow, or some unknown entity that lives within the snowstorms. Roof tiles. Any building that looks as though they are older should be avoided. If one goes near any entrance to these houses, a roof tile will dislodge and strike the wanderer's skull, killing them instantly. Black ice. Slipping on black ice will almost always cause a skull fracture upon landing. Carbon monoxide. There is a chance that using any of the stoves will release carbon monoxide at an alarmingly quick rate, suffocating anyone inside a building if the windows are closed. Food poisoning. A large majority of the food has a chance of being fatally poisoned, the reason being that they may be out of date or contaminated. Electrical fires. A lot of the electricity can falter and start an electrical fire, burning the person inside a house. The fire, however, does not spread to other buildings. Stray branches. Although uncommon, the occasional branch can either fall from a tree or be carried by the wind. If this happens, it will always strike a wanderer's head, killing them instantly. Large openings. Occasionally, the ground may open up beneath a wanderer. This will drop the traveler into a chasm beneath the ground dying upon hitting the rocky floor. Entrances and Exits Level negative 81 can be accessed from the towns of level negative 7. The factory in level negative 7 will occasionally dispense a white mist. Making contact with this mist teleports a traveler to level negative 81. Another method of access is to find an oak door in level 26, which will sometimes bring someone to the exit of a house inside level negative 81. Exits Due to the volume of deaths that happen within just a few days of entry, no exits to level negative 81 have been found.